My name is Andrew Williams. I'm the lead pastor at Church on the Hill. I am also the author of a brand new book that is being published by a publishing arm of our church called Hillside Publishing. And the book is called The Stories That Make Us Practicing the Parables of Jesus. And this book is really special, uh, not only to me, but to our church, because this book was birthed here at Church on the Hill. I guess about last year I began preaching a sermon series on the parables of Jesus and how oftentimes the parables of Christ mystified the original hearers of these parables to talk about how can we begin to dig deeper into these, not just not engage them because they're difficult, but actually engage them in a way that will lead to our spiritual growth. So of course you can find uh, the stories that make us on Amazon, uh, Barnes and Nobles, pretty much everywhere that books are sold, you can get a copy. I would love if really for me, writing is a ministry. It's something that uh, for me is a calling and really the purpose of this is to get this in people's hands so that they can spiritually go in Christ. And that's my prayer for you. So during his time on earth, Jesus tended to mystify the religious authorities, his countrymen, even his closest friends. He often defied their expectations, walking on water, sleeping through storms, ministering to children and Samaritans, and the ultimate twist, giving himself up to be crucified. He spoke of an otherworldly kingdom, of loving enemies, of losing life to find it, all confounding and seemingly impossible concepts, told with the command, follow me. But Jesus' teachings, given in the form of relatable and practical stories, or as we know them, parables, often deepen the mystery rather than actually clarifying it. These multi-layered stories unnerve, perplex, and attract people from all walks of life. In the ancient world and today, like Jesus' first followers, we often only kind of brush the surface, missing out on sort of the deeper meaning and transformative power within them. For those who have heard and read these parables before, the stories that make us summons us to sit again at the feet of Jesus, perhaps understanding, hearing, doing, changing for the first time. So for both of those who are new to these stories and those revisiting them, this book is meant to be an opportunity to meet both the storyteller and the hero of the story. As Jesus says, come see a man who told me everything I ever did.